Hi, my name is Alicia Marie Cruz. I went to the University of St. Joseph's and I majored in public policy and advocacy with a double minor in Spanish and psychology. When I first started my freshman year, I saw myself as being a police officer for this, um, the city of Hartford. But as I studied more policy at the University of St. Joseph's, I definitely want to get more into the policy aspect. So I, I just really want to focus on working for policy. And when I recently inter, uh, interned to, I recently had an internship with uh, State Representative Brandon McGee, and he kind of opened the door for policy for me. And uh, I was able to experience and feel what it is to work for policy, and that's something I'm really interested in doing in the future. My dream job would be, honestly, at this moment, I don't really have a dream job. I think whatever, wherever I work, where I change people's lives, I think it'll be a dream for me. It doesn't matter where I am as long as I make a difference. If I were to give advice to incoming scholars, it would be to focus from beginning to the end because every minute counts. It doesn't matter if it's just your freshman year or just your senior year, every minute counts, so don't take anyone for granted. Hartford Promise means the world to me because if it wasn't for this scholarship, I wouldn't have had the college experience I had. I 100% completely enjoyed my college experience and if it wasn't for the Hartford Promise, I wouldn't have been able to have the experience I had on campus with my residential community. I want to thank everyone in Hartford Promise who put their all into making um, our dreams come true. I also want to thank my family for always supporting me. And I also want to thank Richard Sugarman. Um, he has been a true aspiration from the beginning and he, know, he always knows how to rise us up. I love you class of 2020, this is still our year. I love you class of 2020, this is still our year. I love you class of 2020, this is still our year. I love you class of 2020, this is still our year.